Hello everyone and welcome back to Next Space Rebels where I continue to ponder these tags in an effort to use them to get more followers so that we can get the ultimate engine. That is my goal. I just want that one part. Darn it. I want to see what its stats are and everything. Uh, so last time I was building a rocket that was supposed to fulfill which one? Uh, was it dress up? Yeah. Uh, for using a mannequin and combining it with 10 parts from other sets. I think it means just 10 parts, not 10 different sets or anything like that. And it doesn't mean at least 10 parts. It means exactly 10 parts, I think, was the problem. I was using more than 10 parts from other sets. So, we've got a mannequin and I'm going to, oops. And I'm gonna try it and we'll just count off just 10 parts from other sets. Okay, that's sorta covering things. It doesn't matter how high we get though. Anyway, it's just a theory. I don't know if this is what they meant by the 10 parts from other sets. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 right now. Hmm. Well, we'll just leave the connector. Oh, I didn't even count the connectors, so we have to... Okay, somewhat smaller rocket. But I think this is 10 other parts. I wonder how I managed to fulfill it. Because there's no way it was this small a rocket when I did it, right? Because I thought it was an orbital rocket when I got it in sandbox mode. But okay, there's exactly 10 other parts. We've got the mech in there. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Alright, let's see what happens. There's no gimbal, we're just going straight up. Uh, well, maybe we should check whether our thrust vector is good. Okay, build. Yep, we are not doing that. Somebody had mentioned some other technique with the mannequins. So I'll take a look at that in a bit. Well, it's going nice and straight up. It's got to get pretty high, too. Not that it helps us with the actual tag, but maybe it'll grab some other tag or something. I doubt it, though. So, the other comment was, uh, I don't know how to say the person's name, but, uh, Zerus? I don't know. Uh, combo of millipede, insect, skeleton, Frankenstein, and spider. Sounds like a Halloween party. Uh, so, lots of creepy and wild things, using ten limbs in total. Okay. Well, we'll give it a go. I'm, I'm up for expediting this as much as possible. This is a long burn time, actually. If this is what the cluster engine can do, can you imagine what the ultimate engine can do? Maybe the ultimate engine is the key to making the eco fuels or the algae fuels work. Mm. Well, we have continuously burned to 200 kilometers. We should at least have a sounding rocket business. They're not charging us after all. If you don't have to pay for the rockets. You might as well go to space. <laughs> as far as this game's longevity, you know that uh, the fact that we can't make proper orbits is a big downer. And uh, that acceleration holding us back makes me sad. Of course modding would help too. But I don't care, we should be able to compete for who gets to the highest heights or the fastest speeds. Okay, got to 1,265, I guess, and that's pretty typical. All right, finish. Just uncommon tags. So that idea of what we would be getting doesn't work. Yeah, so that did not get us the tag we wanted. Whatever. Okay, let's just put a whole bunch of those limbs together and see what happens. Corkscrew, 10 loopings. Maybe we can do that too. We might as well do 10 loopings to cap it off. I guess we'll have the torsos in the middle. Okay, well, we got the lot. We're gonna get some extra drag here. And I am going to add a gimbal for looping. Just buying tags, I'm probably never gonna get enough for the ones I need, so. We're just going to have to experiment to some extent. Okay, well, that'll be a good enough start anyway. We'll see how it goes. Left, right for steering. 
Okay, now launch. We'll get some height first. Okay, begin looping. Oh no, the things fell off. Well, it didn't say that we had to carry them the whole way or anything. We're gonna go for a record number of loopings. I hope it's not like we have to hit exactly the number of loopings. Oh, we're going down. Let's go up some more, otherwise we won't get... Oh, up. Come on. We need to go up more so that we can continue looping. Okay, proceed with further looping. This would so make the fuel unsettled in realism overall in Kerbal Space Program, but anyway. Uh, the angle thing makes it look like we're going much faster. Whoa, but just sort of stuck there. I think, I think that's a camera thing or anything else. I think we're spinning. Well, I don't know. It's weird. Okay. Well, we've done a lot of spinning. Let's have a crash into the ground. Maybe that'll get us extra points. I don't know if losing the mannequin parts will hurt us. Guess we should tuck those in a little bit better. And... Well, we saw a little bit of a smack into the ground there. Alright, record loopings, 150, there we go. We did get a viral tag of some sort. Okay. Let's upload the video. Corkscrew, so we did the loopings, but... Um... Well, we got Spider for eight limbs. Frankenstein, we got. Walk. All right, plane. I'll, I'll take what I can get, I suppose. Creepy combo. But not that many. Hmm. So I don't know, the 10 limb, uh, let, let's see, maybe, maybe it just needs to be limbs, so we'll just, no, well, maybe we should buy another tag, just let's see. In control. Spending five seconds pressing buttons to control a swivel? Well, I should have gotten that already, shouldn't I have? Maybe. I don't know how they count it, though. Okay, we'll take the torso parts out. And put more limbs and see if that helps. Maybe we'll tuck the limbs in. Except for the ones down below. We'll put some aerodynamic thing to protect it. Okay, well, I guess... Uh, well, it's, it allows me to build without uh, selecting a challenge, so alright. What is this? There's two launch. What is that? Oh, we get to change launch sites now? Okay, well that's new. I didn't notice that before. Maybe I was just blind, but it looks like we can change launch sites now. I like this one. Let's see. Okay. Huh. When did that happen? So, if we don't choose a challenge and build, it'll let us choose the launch site? Uh, it didn't seem to do that during uh, Sandbox before. Okay, uh, spend five... Oh, I lost a mannequin part. I lost more mannequin parts. I'm dropping... Why Why do the structural pool parts not protect the mannequin? It said five seconds controlling the gimbal, right? Should have been more than five seconds already. It's wiggling around. Let's plunge into the ground. Maybe there's a record for if you plunge into the ground really, really fast or something. Oh, it just disintegrated. Okay. Uh, viral tag. Well, we got something. Millipede. Ten limbs. Okay, well. That was one of those mentioned, but I don't seem to get a combination of these things. Well. We're using only the mannequin structure. Let's just go for... Weird or creepy and just like 
even if it's not I've I've been looking only at the viral tags but maybe if we just do epic tags and focus on the category well there's some other thing that this could go with three round parts in a three leaf clo clover shape two rectangular shaped parts to create a V shape well, it's, that's only smart, though. Let's see, smart and wild. That sounds like me. Now, um, tail part rotated downward. Let's let's combine these things. We'll get some wild combo here. All right, let me just start mocking this up. We'll just use, we'll keep it simple because it doesn't require us to get anywhere in particular. So, round part, well, when I think a round part, I think bicycle wheel so we'll have three bicycle wheel parts in a three leaf clover configuration I don't know if it counts if they're covered up or not but all right that's three round parts in a three leaf clover all right and then straight parts in a v-shape like antennae it doesn't matter to me if it's efficient or not at this point uh, what else do we have Inverted tail, all right. So first I'll have an inverted tail part. And I'll have some additional structure. Maybe the clover leaf has to be free though, I don't know. I don't know the rules for these shape things. It's horrible drag, but I don't need it to go anywhere. Um, got the inverted tail. Let's see, what else? There's also complicated for smart and we have smart here 25 structural parts though reaching an altitude of 40 kilometers well maybe we should just aim for 40 kilometers I don't know if our drag with our drag it's good enough but that's no other structural sets except for PVC triggering three explosions three different time sensors well that's smart apparently well, let's put some simple fireworks on here. I think it was mostly interested in having three. So, let's have it up to three seconds, that's fine. Uh, four seconds, uh, five seconds. Seven seconds. Alright, a little bit soon, considering the expected duration of this, but we'll see. Alright. That's sort of a mess. Let's see what happens. Go. Okay, we got one firework. That one ripped off. I think those just ripped off. I don't think they actually fireworked. It's taking too long. Okay, I'm not gonna belabor this one. Let's just finish. Maybe, well, I think we were only going for rare tags, so that's nominal. Right, we got a lot of rare tags. Okay, mm wild. Wild. I definitely want wild. Is a smart combo. That one I don't know about. This is another smart. Okay. We'll go with those. Let's see. It's not the epic or the awesome ones though. But it seems to work pretty well. So uh, even if it's not the epic or awesome one, uh, sorry, epic or viral ones. And we can do good things if we combine them. Alright. So, what can we do next? Cute? Can we do a lot of cute? Two engines. Seems simple. Uh, that's smart. Two engines. But that's for beating a particular thing. Limb and swivel. Limb and swivel. Using two engines, three upward straight parts for Trident. Okay, limb and swivel, three upward straight parts. Uh, we wanted two engines. Let's have two engines. Let's just have these. We hardly ever use them. Okay, two engines, swivel, limb, three upward straight parts at the same height that are not connected. Okay.
Yeah, let's go into an open field. That's probably better. Looks sort of like a guy. Okay. Go. Oh, it's not even lifting off. Does it matter if it doesn't lift off? I'm actuating our limb. Oh, our limb is sort of building things. Pretty structurally strong limb right now. So we're crawling along here. Maybe we can get some distance still. Okay. Well, let's see what we got out of that. Rear tags. Let's see if it's just a fortunate combination. Well, we got the trident. We got the motor. We got the alive. We got the ones that we were aiming for. We could probably done with uh, two more ideas. Double barrel is another smart thing. We haven't used that before, so we might as well. Okay. Well, plenty of views, plenty of follows. Try something more nuclear, yes. Let's do that. Um, maybe that's what the ultimate engine is. Four engines, smart and awesome. And a space shuttle, but that doesn't have any association with either smart or anything else. Uh, smart, reaching a distance of 5 meters without propulsion or explosives. Uh, distance though, that's like ground. We could do that again, but not in combination with stuff probably. Four independent rockets in the air at the same time, all with running engines. So, I mean, we've got four engines. So, four engines all separating off from each other using only the dandy deer set which is probably creepy or something legs are the right sort of idea that's good no that doesn't have good feed speed this goes just go spherical fuel tank all the way that'll give us plenty of thrust Wow, it's amazing how complex this is. <laughs> okay, where's the decoupler? Oh, decoupler is huge. Okay, it should go up pretty vigorously. I don't know if it'll be structurally sound, though. We might want less powerful engines, but we'll see. We're only using structural parts from the Dandy Deer set. We have four independent rockets, four engines. Let's find out. Uh, let's go somewhere safer. That looks good. Alright, launch. And independent, please. I don't know if they're all nice and... Uh, they look independent to me. They're probably breaking apart right now. Alright, finish. Broke apart? Yeah, well, that can happen. Okay, swarm for independent rockets, reindeer, and powerhouse. So we got the ones we were looking for. Uh, three balls. Yes, we did. Uh, minimal. No, it wasn't very minimal, but uh, millipede we used recently, so they might not like that. But it's viral. Does that help or hurt anything? Hmm. Split is smart. Would it be better to go with the fade out viral tag or the one that's uh, we've got awesome too for making a looping well i guess we'll go with uh, well we do looping so often we'll do split okay let's see yeah that wasn't that good let's get some tag or something maybe Bottle flip. For making a looping and landing a rocket on its tail without exploding. Ouch. Hmm. That is an interesting... Interesting challenge though, isn't it? Now oh, they've got me thinking. 
Let's be robust about this. Huh? And of course we'll want something to switch off the engine at the right time. Having a big fin part at the bottom might cause problems for us, but we'll see. I feel like I probably want the center of lift uh, center of mass a little bit lower. We want the center lift higher, actually. Closer to the center of mass, as close as possible. We'll put some extra fins at the top. Still can't drag it up enough. Um, okay, that's close, but it's not saying that it's in violation. Oh, there's in violation, okay. So, hopefully that'll be optimally stable? I don't know. Okay, well, we'll see what happens. Well, okay, a road. That's fine. Okay, do a flip. I can't see it anymore, though. Uh, is that close enough to my my tail? No. Well, well, no. Let's not upload that. Hmm... Just seeing it is going to be tough, so we want less power here. We're back to the flying bedstead kind of situation again. Maybe I should just use that. We have to do a flip though, which is annoying. Yeah, let, let's just see if I can pick that one up again. If I can find it because they don't sort things in any reasonable sort of order. Cover cat. Okay. Okay, hopefully this is all good. Up, down, left, right, left, right. Wonder why I even have that one as up, down, but... Well, I might have to practice again with this because it's been a while. Uh, uh, okay, it wasn't the landing. <laughs> oh, I got a rare tag. Let's see. Adult. Oh, we'll hardly ever get that one again. We'll need a bit more height. At least I don't have to hit particular heights, but get, keeping an eye on it. Maybe we should just get to 100 meters first. But then it'll switch cameras right at the end, though, you see. Oh, it's, it gets spinny. And landing. Landing is hard. Yeah, I think this might be a little bit beyond me, or I'll have to think more about it. These aren't exactly throttling engines. We have the gates, but it's still complicated. Probably not the most straightforward way, and it's not, I don't even think it was a viral tag. Or maybe it was. It is a viral tag. Maybe we should just use solids. It's more predictable. We just need a loop engine that has just... Or loop SRB that has just enough juice to loop. Once. Now this is horrible aerodynamically, but I wonder what it'll do. Trigger after one second. I, I just wonder. Just curious. Let's see. Yeah, I'll be fine. Oh, it didn't have enough force. Well, obviously gonna get dragged, but let's see. After one second, it's gonna do that. Oh, I can't even get off the ground. But landing is still gonna be a pain. Or complete dumb chance. Well, see, that didn't last long enough going up. And I feel like we sort of need something like this going on. 
This specific point is red. That's balanced. Less than that is balanced. Let's try a bank of four of these. Can't get off the ground. Four of those little ones definitely knocked it to one side, but... Okay, we're gonna use this twin one. There you go. Well, we sort of flip. We got a rare tag. Let's see what it was. Giga boost. Five boosters. Nah. Okay, we need to delay those a little bit more. Go. Maybe delay them a little bit more. <laughs> oh, they, I don't think they even fired though. I think that was just aerodynamics pushing us around. Let me see. Yeah, that was just aerodynamics pushing us around. Okay, well, then we should probably just reduce our finage. Uh, we'll just uh, get rid of these fins first. I mean, that would be a technique, but it happens too quickly. I don't know if it flipped. I don't know what it's doing. It's gone too high. Hmm. It's definitely not the tail. Maybe what we need is overwhelming power so that it manages to flip. We, we don't need these. What we need is just uh, maybe less finage. It'll, it'll want to flip. Hmm. Maybe those controllable wings might be the idea. But we'll try it just uh, kit fins. Let me just see what happens with this. Ah, oh, that just goes straight up. Okay, so they don't have enough influence. Deployable fins would be something. Fold these in and deploy the other ones. These are the individual wings that uh, would be able to control it. Let me see what this does. Ooh, almost. I, I actually touched the ground a few times. Oh, it did sort of land. Ah. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Let me just mess with this a little bit. It lasts too darn long. <gasps> oh! Man. We need bigger fins at the bottom. Let's see. I didn't even flip. Okay, that was too stable. Okay, now it's unstable-ish. Oh, it went, like, directly... Hmm. That's weird. At a certain speed, I guess it was stable. Oh. Hmm. These are too good, if there's two of them. Maybe just some slight addition. There you go. Come on! Stick it! Stick it! Oh. I don't know if it would count if you flip multiple times. Feel like it's close to sticking that landing though. Just make it wider. <laughs> wider base! Gotta help, right?
Oh! That didn't help much. Okay, uh, maybe we should go down on the booster power. This lasts too long. It is the same burn time though. It's just not gonna go up. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We've got the same problem we had before where we don't have a solid booster in the in the power range that I was looking for. Okay, still not quite powerful enough. Uh, oh no. We need to go up a little bit higher. Got a rare tag there though, but... We're going for that viral tag, so that happens too soon. Maybe... What happens if I move it like this? It doesn't do anything. It doesn't flip. Okay, so yeah, we do need it. We need the center of lift above the center of mass for it to actually do the flip. Maybe right on. But, I don't know, not quite getting it, but this seems like it'd be a more straightforward approach and predictable approach than trying to steer it. Hmm, I'll have to think about this. Maybe this is not, not the tag to do, but I think I've done enough experimenting. It's gonna be interesting. We're gonna have to do some crazy stuff in order to get all the new followers I need. So we'll see what we can combine. Two wing-shaped parts with a figure. I mean, that's doable. I wish we could filter out all the ones that are just challenge specific. It'd be a lot easier to look at this. Let's see, that's a being a challenge, being a challenge. All these being a challenge ones I don't need. Assuming that I can't do them again, right? Three can be done. There's plenty that can be done. We are just going to have to figure out how to manage it. So, I will continue plugging away at this so that I can get the ultimate engine and see what that's like. And But for now, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do press like. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them in the comment section below. And I'll see you next time.